Bars and restaurants are looking forward to a good day of business on Super Bowl Sunday. We stopped by a couple of them this evening to see how busy they are getting ready for the big game. Brian Wilk joins us now live in the control room with more. Brian. Hi Jennifer. While those places are busy, it also means there's a few roadblocks in their way. Pizza, ribs, chicken wings, all popular things folks love to eat while watching the big game. Erie Arena Sports Bar on French Street is getting ready, but dealing with the rising price of chicken wings. I think that there's a lot of shortages. There's uh, issues with delays and ordering, and we're having a hard time getting product as if we can get product. So it's kind of at this point just a matter of where we can get it and make sure that we're not passing that price on to the, the guest and trying to recoup it in other places. A lot of people are already placing their orders for the game. We have quite a few people that are calling those orders in early to make sure that they're getting them. And uh, that's all we can ask for is get, get those orders in early. Otis 12 Sports Bar and Grill is also busy planning and ordering enough food. They too are dealing with high chicken wing prices. Yes, yeah, so we haven't had any issues so far with supply. However, the price of the wings on our end has not come down at all. We were hoping, you know, that it would at some point, but it always normally rises again around Super Bowl, so we're hoping possibly afterwards that it'll come down. But that doesn't stop people from placing orders. We try to do in 15 minute time slots um, to schedule it out. That gives us an idea going into the Super Bowl, knowing how busy we're going to be, how to staff, where to put people. Um, and obviously the closer we get to the time the Super Bowl starts, the busier we are. Both places said while they're paying more for chicken wings, the price they're selling them to the customers is staying the same. Jennifer. All right, Brian, thank you.